Nine past eight now. Well, still to come, is there room for two fun parents? We'll find out shortly. But right now, one of Australia's funniest actors, Shane Jacobson, has embarked on a weight loss journey, becoming the new face of Jenny Craig. I'm, I'm going to lose 15. That, that's where I start. That's, that's, that's the target. Um, and we'll see where we go from there. I think I've got the hang of this. <laughs> Joking. <laughs> Not a bad start. Good morning to you, Shane. Good morning. Well done to you. Was there yeah. a moment when you decided, okay, I've had enough now? Yeah, it was, uh, I went to, well, it wasn't that I'd had enough, because I'm, I come from a long line of really proud Jacobson big men. We're a clan. And we've been celebrated every time, you know, when, you, when a guy walks into a pub, if you're a big guy like me, everybody goes, here comes the big boy, get out, big Jake. So it's kind of a, it's a good thing with us. Um, but it was, so I, I had no issue with it, but uh, and, you know, I look at people like Brad Pitt. I don't want to look like Brad Pitt. I want to eat Brad Pitt. <laughs> uh, You're not the just, only one. <laughs> that, I just realised how weird that sounded. <laughs> oh, thank goodness we're not going live. We'll edit that. Uh, and I mean with gravy, not with love. Uh, there's a difference. But um, I was, my doctor's a guy that, that I admire, respect, uh, and I trust. And I went for a checkup, and he said, let's take your tire pressure and, and, uh, and your cholesterol. And he said, they're high. Uh, and, and I did honestly go, hey, you know, she'll be right. And, uh, and he said, look, mate, he said, if, if you were my brother or, or, and a mate, which you are, I consider you a friend, he said, but if you were my brother, I kind of wouldn't let you, I wouldn't want you out there walking around with your blood pressure the way it is without me medically intervening. And he said, so we can just put you on medication, you'll just be on for life. And I went, okay, that, that feels a bit different. And at that point, I went, it's time to do something. But you're going to have the problem, I think, uh, a lot of people have and a lot of blokes have, when the people around you say, but if you lose weight, you won't be the shame we know and love. Yeah, I know. Well, I, I, the thing that worried me is, what if, what if my fat is the funny bit? I'm out of work. So when I get thin, I'm going to get thin on pay as well. But yeah, you know, cause a, lot of, a lot of big people are only funny when they're fat. So this is the end of my career, folks, but I'm going to live <laughs> forever. Yeah, we're watching it live. <laughs> so how do things differ? How long have you been on the, on the diet now? Only two weeks. And so how does what you're eating every day differ from what you were eating? Like, is there a particular thing that you're really missing? Yeah, well, for, for tea, what I used to do uh, was kind of grab as much livestock as I could get, and I'd get them all to walk into the oven mm -hmm. uh, with armfuls of vegetables <laughs> uh, and just get plenty of room up the back. In you, so, you know, I'd have a big lamb roast, and I'd just stack livestock on top of each other yeah. and, uh, and just push them in. But it was uh, So the thing is now, I actually think I'm eating the same or if not almost more than I used to, but I used to not eat until 2 o'clock in the afternoon. And then sometimes eat dinner at nine o'clock at night, you know, and then sleep on that. And you know, as we all know, breakfast is break fast. So now I just I just have a breakfast. Then I have I eat like every two hours. I graze and have, but I'm still eating quite a lot. But my metabolism's fired up, and it's just the weight's falling off. And you're doing exercise as well? A little bit. <laughs> The other day, I ran into a mate of mine when I got here, so that was a run this morning. I ran up a bill on my credit card, massive bill. Uh, so, and, and this is the part I have to confess, and, and, and Jen for men are fine with me saying this, uh, but I'm still having a few beers at night. And, uh, and a glass of wine, so, and I'm still losing weight. And if that means that you know, you, you're not feeling deprived, no. then you're probably guaranteed to lose the weight you want to yeah, lose. Jenny Craig are very successful. They've, 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 the stats are that people that are on Jenny Craig and Jen for Men, that statistically they, the weight stays off. Um, I mean, Magda's been on it more famously than most, and Chrissy. And, uh, but the thing is, they, do, they, they, they don't want you to rush to get the weight off. They're, they're, they're quite careful about letting you know there's no rush to do this. this is yeah. a, and it's not really a, a diet, it's an education and a lifestyle. Yeah. Um, um, so I'm just eating better foods, and like I said, it's, and it's also about portion sizes, um, uh, because you know I, I was devastated when I saw that a palmer is supposed to be the size of the palm of your hand. Um, but plates are now. What palm tree? I would, I would, I would just, um, for me, it was like when you cut a tree, straight through the middle of the animal. You know, just cut the ears and tail off and eat the rest. But, um, <laughs> but the, the the reality is, plates have got bigger. Like if you go to your grandmother's cupboard. That's very true. Um, uh, you know, let her know you're coming. She'll freak out when she sees some stranger going through her cupboards. But the plates were this big, and then you filled that plate. Now, our pl the plates I have at home, I mean, they're this, they're this big. Yeah. But, well, they're not. But they're, they are that big, and you just fill your plate, you know. So uh, it's about portion sizes as well. All right. Well, congratulations, because it's not an easy thing to do, but, but no. once you're on it, you're obviously committed. So, um, and, and we love watching you on Top Gear, by the way. You're having too much fun at the moment. Yeah, no such thing as too much fun. <laughs>
No such thing. Lovely to see you, Shane. Thanks, mate. You too. Over to you, Carl. Oh, sorry, just quickly, for more details on Shane's weight loss program, just head to our website. Now it's your turn, Carl. How good is livestock stacked on top of each other? <laughs> Aussie beef and Aussie lamb all in one sandwich. Doesn't get any better than that.